Welcome to the plus add-on tutorials. Today I gonna demonstrate hotspot pinpoint widget for you. First of all, in the hotspot menu, you need to select the background image. From here, you can select the background image. Then, you need to add the multiple pinpoints that you can buy the duplicating or add item if you add item there will be a various options for each pin in the pin you have the option for the icon image or the text so you can use icon you also can use the image or you can use the text version you will see the different options and different examples available in our demo page if you select the icon then there will be there will be the option for the font or some or the icons mine if you select the icons mine there will be another options for all the icons available so for example let's stay with the font awesome then you can select any icon then you have the option for the icon color and the icon background color which also available for the normal and the whole condition as you can see there is the icon color which is the white and the background color changes from red to blue then you have the option for the position these are the important options by which you can position your pin on the image so you have the left right top and the bottom options so you can adjust these positions and these positions you can change for the tablet and the for the mobile if you keep keep this turned off that means this desktop positions will be absolute for the tablet and the mobile then you have the option for the pin in the pin you have first of all select the content text or the linking editor so you can choose anything then you can put on the content in it you also have the text alignment option the typography option in the typography you can select the font family the size weight and all the other other options related to typography then you have the option for the text color in the style tab of the pin content you have the all tooltip options in which you can select the tooltip interactive if you keep this enable you can select the content from the pin if you key, if you make it turn off you will not be able to select any content or even go to the link or any section in your pin then there is the option for the position select theme width of the tooltip the offset value the distance arrow type arrow color the trigger you can make it on hover or on the click then you have the animation option for the loading of the pin you also have the duration options in the style you have the padding background type border and the box head options then in the extra options you have the continuous effect variations so you can select any of that and as per the effect there are the cosmetic options available <coughs> after that in the style tab If you have selected the pin icon, you have the option for the icon. If you have selected the image, these are the options for the image. And if you have selected the text, these are the options for the text. So, for example, if you have selected pin icon, that is the icon size option available, the pin width available. You also have the radius, icon radius option. Then there is the box shadow, which is available for the normal and for the hover condition. 
then if you have selected the pin image <coughs> then there is the pin image size width border radius and in the text there is the typography and the other options available in the extra option there is the option for the hover overlay color that means if you hover on the any pin the background hover color will be changed you can see the example over here if you turn this on there is the background color option then there is the option for the on scroll view animations in the on scroll view animation you have the various options we also have make made this another tutorial on on scroll view animation which you can check on our channel hope you enjoyed this video tutorial on hotspot pinpoint if you have any other questions write us on the comment box below subscribe to our channel for more video like this do check all the links in the description below thanks for watching and keep crafting amazing websites see you in the next video